Good morning, middle school. Buenos dias, estudiantes. Bonjour, estudiantes. Today is an F day. Please stand and recite the flag. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. For lunch today, a hot dog on bun with pasta salad, baked beans, and assorted fruit. For sports, we have a soccer girls JV game, 5 p.m. home versus Beth Haverling at Livonia High School. Attention middle school students, order your 2018 yearbooks by September 29, 2017 and receive four free icons of your choice. Pick up a form by the main office or order it online at jobstudent.com. All band students, please bring your entertainment books tomorrow. The end of the sale is Friday and all books need to be returned. Interested in a career in music? Come join us for a first lunch and learn on Wednesday, October 4th. We'll Skype with a Livonia graduate who works in the music industry. Sign up in Mrs. Pagano's office. If you have any questions, see Mrs. Pease. We have one special announcement. <clears throat> Excuse me. Morning, everybody. Two quick announcements just to make sure we're all on the same page. Number one. Early next week, we're going to be sending a letter home, and that letter is going to explain to parents that the eligibility policy that we built last year and that we said that we would implement this year is going to begin in the second marking period. Let me say that again. The eligibility policy, some people call it the ineligibility policy, but we like to be, put a positive spin on it. The eligibility pol policy will start on the first day of the second marking period. Everybody starts a square one, okay? Um, that gives us about a three week notice. We just wanna make sure everybody's clear. We're gonna be sending a letter home to explain it. And then as we get closer to that date, we will explain it more in more detail here on the morning news. So that's the first thing. Second thing is Erla. Lots and lots of sixth and seventh graders are getting leveled. You're doing a fantastic job. I'm seeing teachers level kids in the halls and their classrooms and just really spending time with each other talking about reading. Okay, I'm going to ask that you read as much as you possibly can. Put down the clicker on the television for that 30 minute program that is not going to teach you anything other than probably something that the world wants you to see as valuable as it is or really valuable. Okay, get into a book, pick the book you want, read it, have a great time with it. Okay, that's 30 minutes a day at home. If you can go 45, that's awesome. Okay, you're going to get to read time here in school as well. So you'll have time in your classes throughout the, throughout the year. We have a rotation for that. If you're sitting in study hall and you say, oh, it's so boring because I don't have anything to do, take out a book. Okay, don't waste the time. All right? Make sure that you're reading every chance you can. Your vocabulary will go up. Your ability to read will increase. And, and I promise you this will be something that you'll say later. Well, I'm really glad I did that because I got into the college that I wanted to or the career that I wanted to or I... I got to, to pick what I wanted to do in the military. Whatever path you take, it's just absolutely going to help you on that path. So to recap, Erla, read every chance you can. And number two is the eligibility policy will be coming out. I think it's the third Monday in October. We will tell you way more as we get closer, but I wanted you to hear it first because you're going to be getting a letter home in the, in the mail uh, sent to your parents probably by the middle of next week. That's all I got. You guys ready? My back. Have a Flamingo Friday, middle school.